Hey everybody, this is Andy Bennett with the CSS News Civil War Interpret Center back with our Civil War cooking series. In this video, we're going to be doing a recipe that may have been done during the Civil War. Sometimes we just have a list of what ration soldiers were issued within a certain time period. We either pick these up from letters or we know from governmental records what the soldiers were issued. In late May, early June of 1864, the Battle of Cold Harbor occurred. Uh, Grant's overland campaign, he's trying to be, is get ahead of Robert E. Lee and cut him off from Richmond. Um, Cold Harbor, the battle takes place near Mechanicsville, Virginia. The things we know North Carolina soldiers were issued, we know they were issued bacon, we know they were issued rice, and we know they were issued split peas. Uh, so there's many different ways you can cook these things together, but uh, one of the more simple, easy, logical ways of cooking those would be what I've cooked over here in the, the pot. And I'm going to dish some out because it's, it's ready, to, ready to eat, right? Is what we've done here is peas take the longest to cook so what we've done is I went, went on and cut some up of our, our bacon our side meat uh, and put that in the water with our peas because they're gonna take a long time to cook and boiled them and boil them till they're breaking up and then threw our rice in there and uh, that's why our rice has this nice green tint, right? Now, do we know soldiers concocted this uh, exact recipe? We don't, but there's many cooks as there are. There's many variations of how to cook something. Um, so this is a real simple and pretty nutritious meal. We get protein in our peas, rice or carbohydrate. We get a little more protein and fat from our bacon. So it was a real balanced pretty tasty meal if I don't say so myself. Um, as I said, it, meals vary on what soldiers were issued, how much time they had, what access to cooking utensils, water, and firewood. But one of the major uh, ingredients in any of these recipes is the inventiveness skill of the cook. A lot of people complained uh, that you know guys taking turns uh, cooking, they event wouldn't take long for them to figure out who was the best cook, and hopefully make them the camp, their camp cook or their company cook as soon as possible uh, to get this tasty meal produced. I uh, hope you're enjoying these videos. I try to keep them nice, short, and sweet. Uh, as always, you can check out our videos on YouTube, Facebook, and Instagram. Join me back for another video soon.